hey guys welcome to the final tutorial of written book session for library management system so today I wanna show you how return button will work first of all when we click the return button it automatically delete the data from issue book issue book from from this database the book ID is one it automatically delete deleted from here and will be transferred to the return book so we have to make like that okay so let's proceed first of all i am going to back button work So now on the return button so as we know we have to perform two <coughs> operation at a time first is deletion and another one another one is insertion in the return book database that is we have to delete from insert book and post it into return book so we have to perform two works at a time so we have I am going to create a function here public void delete function So the delete portion is completed. So I am now I am going to create the insertion part.
copy all this Now copy this all and paste 14 times. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and last one is fifteenth. Fifteenth. So let's see the design. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and last one is fifteen. So. <coughs> now for the date session that will be oops Rexfield J date chooser one dot get date editor function dot get text just copy this and paste it here and make it 15 now we are done PST dot execute So now we have to call the call this function delete and return update function to the button click. So return up update function. So now we have to last check the check that this is working or not by clicking shift f6 that is a shift shortcut code of running same frame so if we type if we type any other id this will not show anything book id is not issued with this
student id we have to put that id which is issued so we have issued is 929 so 929 see every detail is completely coming here by doing the search <coughs> button now when you completely run with starting then it will be automatically resized uh, that's why is it not working cause we have not added j tattoo in this frame if if you run this from the starting this will automatically auto corrected so not don't worry about this so select the date of return is today now return this or oh, we have error something in the sql so cut this and So the error is <coughs> now the error has been done now we, i am any i am going to run this program student id is 465 return date today return so book has been written so <coughs> as you have been seeing that how it is working so now check return see every data has been successfully created and from the issue book the data has been deleted so thank you for watching this video hope you like this so now i have only last last tutorial that is statistics and about so i i will done this in next tutorial which which will be which will be um, i publish within two or three days cause i have too many works so stay tuned and please do thank you for watching this video and please subscribe and comment below below the section so thank you